Picture a world where cancer is cured with a packet of pills. Where a single injection treats heart disease, Alzheimer's or diabetes. This is the future that was imagined 10 years ago when it was announced that a draft of the human genome had been sequenced. Scientists had cracked our genetic code and had mapped the billions of letters in our DNA. They hoped that this breakthrough would usher in a new age of medicine. <coughs> but Sophie, Emma, and Tom are in search of more than promises. All three of them have their own remarkable experiences of genetic disease. My consultant said it's literally one in a million. You're just extraordinarily unlucky. <laughs> That doesn't really make me feel any better. <laughs> 44 inch waist, 18 stone. Looked like I'd been beaten up because the face had swollen up that bad. In this film, they will go behind the scenes at some of the world's leading research laboratories to find out what the sequencing of the human genome has done for them. They will meet scientists developing treatments based on the genetic information that was unlocked 10 years ago. Wherever the knowledge takes us, the knowledge will empower us to do more. <coughs> Ten years on from the sequencing of the human genome, how close are we to the life-changing medicines that were dreamt of a decade ago? Morning, boys. Can you take your shirt in for me, please? Make yourself look nice and <coughs> <coughs> Where's your blazer, Lewis? Got shit on fire. Sophie Longton lives a double life. Do you know what the shape is? A trapezium. A trapezium, excellent, okay. Mutations in one of her genes mean she has to fight to stay healthy. triangle. Does any of you know the formula for working out the area of a triangle? I love my job and I really enjoy working with young people. A times